Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is Aishram Malayala. In this particular video, I am going to give you the preparation tips for BitSat 2022. So this video is going to be really helpful for all those who are writing BitSat 2022. One of my teacher in my 12th standard used to say that those who are preparing for BitSat 2022, they should really do a lot of hard work when compared to others because of its paper pattern, because of its competition and everything. So if you are someone who wanted to really wanted to stand out of others, and crack bits at do watch the video completely in this particular video i am also going to give you the important chapters and i am also going to show you the cutoffs for each and every branch and each and every campus in the in terms of marks how many marks you need to get in order to get so and so branch in each and every campus so don't miss the video till the end so without taking much time let's get into the video bits at 2022 preparation tips if you see first let me just show you the dates so if you see the dates Online test 1 is going to be held from 2nd July Saturday. Today's date is 22nd June and you are almost having almost like 10 plus days now. Second session is going to be conducted on 3rd August. Almost there is a 1 month gap between these two items. So whatever item you are uh, writing, just watch the video and get uh, some important tips for your preparation. Part 1 will be Physics, Part 2 will be Chemistry, Part 3 will be English Proficiency and Logical Reasoning. And in the Part 4, according to your eligibility, you need to select Mathematics or Biology. So that's how up to you and now now the thing is so for physics you will be having 30 questions and chemistry 30 questions english proficiency 10 logical reasoning 20 and maths 40 questions so here the majority weightage is given to maths it's 40 questions almost all the other parts will be 30 30 30 each so total you will be having 130 questions you will be given three hours here guys one more thing like in this 130 questions so once you attempt all the 130 questions without leaving at least even single question then another 12 questions will be unlocked. So for this 12 questions also, plus 3 minus 1 will be scoring. Okay. Those who don't, uh, I mean, those who leave at least one question are not allowed to open these 12 questions. In the same time, they will not give you extra time for the 12 questions. So if you want to see the 12 questions, you need to attempt all the 130 questions. Once you go to 12, 12 questions, you can't come back to 130 questions. So keep that in the mind. Few people just like that, they attempt each and every question and wanted to see the 12 questions. If you do that, ultimately, if you just guess and keep some questions here in the 130 questions, you will get the negative marking. So keep that in the mind. And you need to solve 130 questions and uh, 130 questions plus 3 for the right answer and minus 1 for the wrong answer. So this is the negative marking. So you will be having the negative marking. So maximum marks from this paper will be 390 marks, right? So that's about the paper pattern. Now you may ask me what will be the syllabus for English proficiency and uh, logical reasoning. For maths, physics, chemistry, though almost like the syllabus will be almost same as it is your JE mains. So you won't be having any other extra chapters or something like that. If you see English syllabus, grammar, vocabulary, reading comprehension, composition, these things will be coming under English syllabus. When it comes to logical reasoning, reasoning, logical reasoning, verbal reasoning and non-verbal reasoning. So all these things will be included in the logical reasoning syllabus. Now, the next thing is paper level. Coming to paper level. Paper level will be, few questions will be almost similar to NCRT and few questions will be almost similar to JE mains. So that means it will be a mixture of both JE mains and NCRT kind of. So it, paper will be balanced with that level. So we can say bit less than JE mains, not very less than JE mains, a bit less than JE mains. Okay. And chemistry portion will be majority will be from NCRT. Majority, I am not saying everything will be from NCRT. Majority will be from NCRT. Maths and physics is a mixture of NCRT and JE level. And can expect model questions from JE PYQs. So if you are preparing for JE events, this makes you work easy. When you write a mock test, you will understand where you are strong, where you are weak, where you are moderate, where you need to improve, where you are things you need to take care of and why, what you are doing the mistakes in the exam. So if you do this, know this kind of practice by writing the mock test, you will improve yourself and you will learn from your own mistakes. So that is going to be a really game changer. If you want to write more relevant mock tests, so I will suggest you a platform which provides you the relevant mock tests for BitSat 2022. That is none other than Career360. Career360 is coming up with this engineering prep combo where you will be getting unlimited mock tests, study material, result analysis and many more. So this is a limited period offer. Actual price is 9,999, but you now the present price is 2,999. But if you use my code CHERAN10, C-H-A-R-A-N-10, you will get 10% discount and final price will be 2699. Let me show you some more details about this particular engineering prep combo. So the step one will be just click the link in the description. After clicking the link, you will just see this kind of uh, interface where you can see this particular engineering prep combo includes BitSat, VATEEE, MAT, SRMJE, AEEE, MSTSET, APMSET, TSMSET. For all these exams, 
you will get the mock test unlimited mock test nothing like 10 mock tests or 5 mock tests or something like that you will get unlimited mock tests for all these exams under one subscription itself which is like 2699 after using my code charan10 so just scroll down after clicking the link in the description scroll down you can just see on the left recommended thing engineering prep combo 299 so with all these entrance exam mock tests click on buy now if you click on buy now so this kind of interface you will get like you need to enter your details and here you need to enter the code charan10 so they will ask you for the promo code c h a r a n 10 10 if you use that final price will be 2699 so at 2699 almost like for bitsat vit met srmj e triple mst set apm set tsm set for all these exams you are going to get the mock test unlimitedly so you can just use the link in the description guys understand the syllabus and exam pattern i already spoke about this particular thing right next thing is once you understand what is the syllabus what is the paper pattern according to that you need to prepare your own study plan like study plan differs from one person to one other person like how you wanted to divide your 24 hours in a day for all the four sections of the exam usually for three sections any how you are going to prepare for other exams so like je mains mz and all so the fourth section is what going to matter logical reasoning and english proficiency so one who scores there is going to get a good uh, good score right so the thing is like you can should you should prepare your own study plan now one more important thing will be like next thing start with your ncert books first try to start with the basic thing ncert books for any entrance exam you need to start do, you should do that and when it comes to bitsat it will be really helpful if you start with ncert and then solve the other books other books can be anything if you are preparing for je mains you will be having some reference book right just follow those books for same for bitsat also but for english proficiency there is some book uh, by disha publication if possible i will leave that link in the description next thing is formula and short notes formula and short notes are really going to important for you if you want to revise quickly and revise everything perfectly you need to first revise formulas and if you want to do it quickly i um, mean complete one concept of one chapter quickly short note is going to be really important if you have them use it if you don't have them if you have some handbooks or something like that use them now the next thing is keep eye on speed accuracy time and time management so it's important to maintain time so if you are you are going to have 180 minutes in that we need to solve one that equations uh, extra 12 questions will be there that is only for those uh, who completes uh, all these one that equations right so those who don't complete one that equation this 12 questions will not be unlocked so let's say only one that equations are there almost like less than one and a half minute you will be having for one question so in that case you need to Uh, keep some timer while solving the pair questions so you should make sure you should try to solve the question less than 1 minute uh, or just little above than 1 minute so don't extend it to 2 minutes or 3 minutes if you do so that will affect you in the exam so for that you need to write mock test then you will understand how much time you are taking and next the thing is like revision so revision is always important when you study something today tomorrow morning first you should revise whatever you studied yesterday and then start the new thing so if you do that you will not forget the old things and at the end again mock test again so i am again stressing on the mock test so here comes the important chapters of physics first try to complete these chapters which i am mentioning here so in the same order what i am showing here like start with heat and thermodynamics and end with work power energy so if you feel there are some more other topics which are left over then try to complete them also first try to focus these so same thing for chemistry start with chemical bonding and end with s block elements so these are for chemistry and now comes to mathematics so start with circles and end with theory of equations and if you feel that there are some other chapters left over in the syllabus complete them after once you complete these chapters okay now comes to important chapters for uh, english proficiency synonyms and antonyms one word substitution sentence completion rearrangements of jumbled words rules of conjugation tenses prepositions models so all these things under english and for logical figure matrix figure formation and analysis analogy test logical deduction series test numerical and alphabetical figure completion test detection of the rule paper folding and cutting so all these things for logical reasoning here goes the cutoffs branch wise cutoffs for pilani campus if you see for uh, bachelor of engineering chemical requires 270 marks out of 390 highest here if you see for computer science in pilani campus you need 372 marks so these are last year cutoffs marked cutoffs you can just check the score there so at least some say if you want in particular pilani campus you need 2 not 3 marks at least 2 not 3 marks are needed to get some or the other seat in pilani campus and next comes to goa campus for computer science here in goa campus you need 347 plus marks and this can be changed this these cutoffs are last year cutoffs and at least if you want some or the other seat here at goa campus 
you need to score 246 for MSc Biological Sciences at least some of the other seat in Goa now comes to Hyderabad for branch wise cutoffs of Hyderabad campus for computer science here you need to score 336 plus and at least some more the other seat if you want for B pharmacy you need to score 161 marks for Hyderabad campus 161 out of 39D so this is the thing okay so you can just see the cutoffs of Hyderabad campus once again and these are the cutoffs for Goa campus marks cutoffs not the ranks cutoffs and these are the cutoff scores for that's it for this video guys i hope you got a very good information out of this particular video if you find this is a time worthy video please do like share and subscribe see you in the next one until then take care bye bye jai hind